Hi everyone, let us discuss this result. So in this result, we have a smooth curve x. f is a continuous function, right? It is defined on an open set G, which is subset of complex plane C. The important thing is, okay, that G contains curve x and m is defined in this way. m is a maximum value of mod f of z and they have stated L. L is nothing but length of that curve x. So we have m and we have l and we have to prove this inequality that is mod of integration of f of z dz over x is less than or equal to m into l. This thing we have to prove. So we will start its proof uh, by given information. Okay. So let me write m we have. So by definition of m. So definition of m says m is the maximum value of mod f of z. So that means all values of mod f of z are obviously less than or equal to m since m is the maximum value. So what can I write here? Mod f of z or you can write f of x of t is less than or equal to m for all t belongs to closed interval a b. Okay. See, this is a very important inequality we have. So that's why I'm calling it as inequality number one. So now focus on this one. We have to prove this one. We will start with left hand side and we will bring right hand side. So let us start. Consider what we have mod integration over x f of z dz. Okay. So in previous video, we have already seen already we have proved one inequality that inequality I'm going to use here. So that inequality says this is less than or equal to integration over x mod f of z into mod dz in previous video we have already proved it okay so you can go back and check see this thing we have so you are familiar with the definition of complex line integral so that definition i'm going to use now that definition says integration we have to write limits here as you can see here x t belongs to closed interval a b that means curve x defined on closed interval a b so i should i should write here integration a to b mod f of z that means you can write f of x of t into x dash of t mod is there so i should apply mod here okay there is no need to apply mod to dt so this thing we have right but see inequality number one says this is less than or equal to m so same thing we have got right so this is less than or equal to m so less than or equal to integration a to b m mod x dash of t dt but you know that when we have constant inside the integration we can easily take it outside so m is a constant let us take it outside so this is equal to m integration a to b mod x dash of t dt okay so you are familiar with this one this is nothing but length of curve x okay this integration gives the value of length of curve x so that that's why and it is already denoted as capital l so i can write this is equal to m into this l okay so therefore therefore we started with what we started with mod of this integration mod integration over x f of z dz right this inequality we have got here so i can write less than or equal to and finally we conclude with m into l so ml so in this way we proved this inequality Make a screenshot of it, then we will stop. Thank you. Bye-bye.